What is up? My name is Scurvy, and today we're going to be reacting to a show called How Far Is Tattoo Far? If you don't know what this show is about, basically, they get two people that hate each other, and they get to pick what the other person gets tattooed on them. It's going to be great, so let's get into it. <laughs> wow. On this episode of How Far Is Tattoo Far, Taylor and her boyfriend Stefan. Brought Stefan Curry up. He's our most hated player I hate in NBA 2K14. And so I was just like, why not? I need to cross up Stefan Curry to show these people that I do not like him. Are giving their relationship a serious test. The duo is into pranks, but they've grown more dramatic than fun. I started a YouTube channel about a year ago, and then he came on one video, and then after one video, he just started popping up more and more. After that, I started kicking my ass with them pranks. <laughs> What's the ultimate prank that you played on her? I had two of her friends some pranks. at my apartment. Sounds like a killer prank. Dude was probably just cheating on her and was like, it's a prank, bro. But it was probably staged and fake. Unlike this show, where they actually had to get the tattoos. He has no mercy. Stefan would like some mercy though when it comes to Taylor's tweets. What's the biggest thing you The biggest are thing I hear about her is that when we get in arguments, she puts everything on social media. Straight yeah. to Twitter. I feel like that's the only way to get his attention. As soon as I put it on Twitter where all his yeah. little friends could see, now he cares and wants so to talk about it. This sounds like a perfectly healthy relationship to me. So, are these tattoos gonna be lifelong pranks? What's the deal? Intentions. My intentions is I want revenge. Letting everybody know our business. What I did to you? Oh. Taylor is obsessed with telling the world our personal business, and I'm over it. If Taylor can't stop, then I'm done with this relationship. What's your intention with this tattoo? I just want to teach him a lesson. I want this tattoo to show the world that Stefan is a complete ass. I thought you already told the whole world on Twitter. These people should just break up or get some major therapy. It's not cool to get help. And then he needs to stop playing with me. If he crosses the line with this tattoo, I'm gonna break up with him. Did you not hear him say he wanted revenge? My intention is I want revenge. Damn, there's a lot riding on these. Let's get these tattoos going. Those are some sick shades they give him. <laughs> if this is a dumb ass tattoo, then this probably be the end of us. You definitely got yourself into some dumb uh... This is my first tattoo, and it feels huge. That's what she said! This only supports my statement even more that he's the biggest ass. After hours in the chair, let's see who will have the last laugh. This is so messed up. Ooh, Steph! I bet not have a dick on me, bro. It's way worse. What could be way worse? Maybe this one? But that's just because of the location. Are you ready to see what's on your chest for the rest of your life? Yes, I am. 100% ready. What the f is this, bruh? <laughs> that's way better than a glizzy. That looks pretty good. You could just get a tattoo artist to cover up the butt and you're all good. Or you could just leave it and it could be a great conversation starter. What the f is this? It is you with a butt face because you're an ass. <laughs> wow. What's the ass? Smoking? I don't even smoke damn cigarettes. It looks like a pipe. A pipe? You know you be like saying, oh, I want my cigars and stuff. You got a hat on? Uh-huh. Got a bathroom tuxedo on with a football card? It's a playbook. You like football. Why do you have my name on me? I know my damn name. I need everyone else to know that that's you. What the f Perfect. Are you serious? I'm tired of you and these pranks. You laughing at my pain is not fun. Stefan, how do you feel about the tattoo? I kind of like it. Get wrecked. <sighs> you think you could learn a lesson from it? Oh yeah, for sure. I definitely could learn a lesson from it. I just gotta communicate more, I guess. Talk out of your mouth instead of your ass. Right. Yeah. <laughs> it's your turn now. Taylor, you know we saved the worst tattoo for last, right? I'm sorry, Taylor. Uh... What's the intention behind this tattoo, Stefan? I want 
revenge. You want the whole world to know that we argue a lot? Here you go. That's why I'm taking so, this personal. You gotta wear I'm a taking it personal with you beach. because you do stuff you know to purposely man? hurt me. You probably gotta wear a turtleneck on your wedding day, too. Shut the f up, Stefan. Shut up. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. No, you're not. Stop being so dramatic. What the f? <laughs> Can I just see it? You dumped? I don't know if the YouTube sign has changed on purpose, but this isn't that bad either. It could still be a lot worse. Why do you have a toilet on my back? What does it say? You're dumped. Like, I'm done. <laughs> Are you being for real? Serious. Oh my god, what the f did I do to deserve this? Like, every time we get in an argument, you have to put out on social media. Like, for what? You, you don't stop. Oh my god. <laughs> I will never forgive you, Stefan. I'll never forgive you. You're never gonna forget him either. It's just a prank, Taylor. I'm not breaking up with you. Hold up, hold up. He pranked her real good. Nobody expects the Spanish Inquisition. There is no way they are staying together. You're straight up saying this whole thing was a prank? Yes. Like, I just wanted you to know, like, I'm the king of the prank war. Just give me my props. No. So you came on the show to prank all of us? Yes. They didn't even know it was a prank. Honestly, we had no idea. Yeah, that's why I was like, you're a piece of <laughs> But now that I know it's a prank, still a piece of <laughs> A prank is not permanent. The prank is something you laugh at in the moment you get over that's it. Why it's I'm so gonna look bad. at this and I'm gonna cry every time I see it. You mean everything to me. I mean <laughs> to you. That was the most belittling, degrading, lowest feeling I've ever felt. He crossed the line, and I'm not gonna get over this. Go run after your woman. I hope Taylor. No way this dude actually ran. He is such a simp. Forgive me, I really messed up. This prank totally backfired and I feel horrible. This is the end of the video. You can stop watching now or stick around. Give me, uh, give me some of that web action. See you, chump.